In this video, we do some fishing on our Hatteras in the Exuma Sound, and then head to Black Point, which has some of the prettiest water you'll ever see. We jump right in there and snorkel with some sharks. In the previous video, we got off the mooring and our crew was getting very experienced at this and made it look easy. Since we were going to be anchoring at our next stop, the crew switched the bridle head over to the chain grabber. After popular demand yeah, of the I'm fans not. and the girls. Yeah, I'm not much of a fisherman, so no, no guarantees here. And y'all gotta watch the lines, because I'm gonna drive. Okay, none of us are fish fishers, uh, sorry for that. None of us are fishers, but we're gonna try to catch something, so. The aft cockpit on our motor yacht makes for the perfect spot to do some fishing. actually got this bait from a kind gentleman that was a uh, mechanic engineer on one of the super yachts said it was his favorite bait to catch what do you remember uh, probably uh, I'm guessing mahi or something mm -hmm. like that sure. so Noah if you're watching this thank you What do you think, Bucky? You enjoying the fish? Huh? We're just gonna wait now. Have you ever fished in your life? No, the first time. I was under my watch when you guys set everything up. Uh, you were watching. I'm watching very the excited, boat. yeah. No luck so far. Don't jump. Not going. <laughs> Even though the Exuma Sound is a great spot to do some fishing, we came up dry. current so the current's coming in right there and so then there's a little bit of the lot of current going this way and then it wraps back around and comes back into itself a little bit it was less than an hour and about eight miles up to black point So I'm going to jump in and fix it. And meanwhile, just check out the anchor. Guys, let me attempt to talk to you about today's sponsor, Manscaped. I say attempt because ever since I've got their brand new shampoo and conditioner and body wash and deodorant, she will not leave me alone. She just wants to smell on me and rub on me all day. So it's gonna be hard to get this done. No matter what I'm doing, I can't get her to leave me alone. I'm trying to start a fire. There she is. I'm trying to get on my motorcycle. There she is. So we're introducing the Platinum 4.0 package from Manscaped, which includes their brand new body wash, their shampoo and conditioner, and their deodorant. And I really like their uh, deodorant because it is aluminum free and it's a clear stick so it won't stain your clothes. So the package also not only includes these things, but it also includes their Lawnmower 4.0, the Weed Whacker Nose Hair Trimmer, their Crop Preserver Ball Deodorant. You also get a couple free gifts, the Shed Luxury Travel Bag, and a pair of their Manscaped Anti-Chafing Boxer Briefs. So right now, if you use my promo code, that's doodles20 at manscaped.com, you can get 20% off and free international shipping. And uh, you can have the same problems I have. So thank you to Manscaped for sponsoring this video. Listen here, I've done made up my mind. Black Point is a large and well-protected bay with beautiful water. We're gonna go into town. One of my favorite places down here is Black Point. Really friendly people. Really friendly people too, and some really good restaurants and stuff. So. Black Point is a really cruiser-friendly settlement, and their town dock makes it really easy to get ashore. All right, good to be back here. We are running out of sunlight. So a lot of people come and hang out here, especially back when people didn't have water makers. You can throw away your trash, there's a market here, there's a bunch of restaurants, and you can get water out of the tap right here for free. Nice. It's not this 
necessary for well, I think their free water spout's gone. Uh, was right there. Now it's just a post. One or a few on there. So they used to have a bunch of goats and sheep right here. And then or they had some like they had their handmade wooden boats that they race. And they're normally here too. There might be one or two up here, but they, they race them out here. Cool. Chicken wing. Ch chicken wing. Chicken wing. Ch chicken wing. I just look back. And she's doing after taking a walk through town, we headed back to the boat. All right, I always leave my chart plotter on when we're uh, at anchor, just to watch my track on here. And you can see my track is zigzagging backwards. It means we're dragging. So our anchor is dragging. So that means we uh, probably need to set out a little more chain because I didn't put out too much because we're only in like eight feet of water. Well, now we're in 10 feet. We only put out 50 feet. So we need to put out about another 30 feet of chain or so, 10 meters or so, and then uh, we'll be good. So we need to do that now. All right, so we let out about 30, yeah, 30, 40 feet more chain. Why are you wearing that? Um, it's a little cold today. <laughs> oh God. Where did Four go? Did she? She only got a wetsuit. Oh God, okay. you girls. But she's going to be wearing like the full length, but I'm just wearing the shorty. And I'm just gonna wear my bikini. I can't take you girls anywhere. Oh, she's gonna wear this cute shorty. Thinking about this. actually doesn't look that deep with this kind of water. Wouldn't you wanna jump in there? Alright. All right. Oh, you're taking a All right. All right. Remember, guys? Come on, come on. Shoulders forward. Or I did it naked. All right, are you guys ready? When you were away. Yeah. No. Yep. Did you? Yeah. All right, are we jumping? Ready? Oh my gosh. Ready? Ready guys? Oh my gosh, really? Three, two, one! <laughs> the water was super clear right under the boat. We even got a visit from a very curious nurse shark. We gotta come back in here because I can't see the screen out there. It's too, too bright. So what do you look for when you're flying to drone? Uh, just the cool shots and make sure I don't hit anything. And technically speaking, I'm supposed to be keeping an eye and line of sight on it all the time, which I am. I'm looking out at it right now. Holding on to long and on resolve. Black Point is one of my favorite places in the Exumas. There's lots of great restaurants, and they're very cruiser friendly. Smile has turned into a frown. I'm moving on. Hello. Stairs. He's waiting for us. Are you ready to go, Bucky? He's already on the swim platform. <laughs> He's like, come on, let's go! What the hell are you doing? We're coming, we're coming, relax. We're coming. All right, so we're heading up to this place on the corner here. The first time I came through, it was nothing. It was like a community center, and now I guess somebody's bought it or done something, and it's a, it's called uh, Emerald Sunset View. I don't know, it's got a really good view. And I mean, they have food and stuff. I'm not gonna say it's I mean, it's if you're gonna food. call yourself a See, I would have a sunset bar and then put it on like the east side of the island or something like well, I've that. I've always said that I wanted to start like a Sailing Doodles Marina and bar down here in the, you get in the, the Bahamas. Joke of that? Oh, I didn't hear anything you say. So, you don't even listen. Do you uh, hear I, this I don't listen either? to her. <gasps> well, he said, I said, if I look, like if I were to open a bar, I'd probably open it on the east side of an island. Get I it? still don't get it. Is it if, if it's Patrick? Is that the joke? <laughs> no. So that you can't see the sunset? Yes, on, I would do that, of course. It's not that uh, hard. All right, Bucky, you're next. <laughs> it's not that funny. I'm going to give you a little no. help. Whee! Oh, I swear. <laughs> No. Way. Oh, are you ready Garrett. to get off? Are you ready to get off? All right, sir. Where are you going, huh? Little clipper. And we're all set for the sunset. Sunset. 
This is the properly named Emerald Sunset View Restaurant. We watched a great sunset there, had dinner, and then headed back to the boat. Someone give me some goggles. Goggles? I'm going to take a look. You're going to go in? No, I'm just going to put my head in. Oh, wow. No Wait, stingrays. There's, that's, those are fish, but there is a stingray. He's right over there. He's right yeah. over there. Yep. He's huge! Look at the f***er. You know, it's easier if you take the snorkel out of your mouth to talk when you're above the water. I really think yeah. I can hear her perfectly fine. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever they are, they're moving really fast. We don't know We don't know if it's a stingray or just a ton of f***ing large fish. Yeah, I don't want to get him either. <laughs> 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 Did I see it? <laughs> yeah, there's one of them right up. Oh, wow. wow! Wow, this is so fast. What is this? What is happening? There's a big one right there. Here. Here. We're all like, look, look! <laughs> like here, babes, here. here. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Black fish, maybe? Jump in, Meg. Yo, it's just fish and their shade. And they're what? Like they're shadows. Shades. shades. Makes them look you mean shadows? <laughs> Freaking Belgians can't speak English. Hey, you be nice. That's a joke. 